Hey YouTube, figured I'd update the 30 gallon, uh, it's been a couple of weeks, it's doing really well, I actually just fed it, there's a couple of pellets left floating up there uh, for the grommy and then to sink down for the, the plecos which are out right now. Here's one of the females, you can see her scrounging around for sunken pellets. Uh, I call her two tail spot because you can see the two spots on her tail. They all have different patterns. Uh, this one over here is like a half circle or crescent, I think. Oh no, this is the male. Uh, you can see he's a little darker. The whites on him aren't quite as brilliant white. Um, I don't see him out very much, so that's really exciting to see him. There's two tail spot. I scared her. Let's see. Walk around the tank, see if I can see the other plecos. There's the littlest female. You can barely see her moving around back there. I almost never see her. So, she doesn't come out very much. So it's exciting to see her. I'm sure you can hear our kitten in the background. The plants in this tank are doing amazingly well. The crypt is putting up leaves almost to the surface of the water. Let's see if I can get it to refocus here. Here's the, the crypt's almost got leaves up to the surface. I still don't know what this really thick spindly plant is that's at the top. Uh, but it's growing crazily now. Here, this is the other pleco. They're all four on video now. This is the crescent, or the half, half circle. This is the other female. I'm pretty sure that I have three females and one male. This one's the bravest of them. You can see a shrimp running around, or a couple of them running around here. There's at least 50 shrimp in this tank now. They've just taken off like weeds. Uh, since I've had that java moss kind of grow out of control, I've had a lot of shrimp that have bred too. I think I'm going to add a couple of x-ray tetras. I have eight in here currently. I think I'm going to add four or five more and then maybe four or five more neons. I have about 12 neons right now. There's pleco drama going on over here. I think the male was trying to bully this female. I'll be putting a new light on this tank in the next week or so, so look for an update about that. I'm curious how it'll change the plant growth. It's an LED fixture. It's going to be the Finex Stingray. So we'll see how it grows those plants. It should make it a low to medium low light tank now. It's low tech, there's no CO2, but you can see I have sponge filters on either side that bubble in oxygen in addition to the agitation that comes from a hang on back filter. Here, 
just two plecos at a time. The other thing, one last thing to point out is this crypt here, the leaves have been getting that brownish red tint. Uh, it's really turning into a pretty plant. I'm really happy with how it's grown in. On the sides here, it hasn't grown in so well. I suspect it's due to the light. We'll see how it does. There's one of the plecos hiding under the wood. Alright, I see him to seven minutes. Thanks for watching, YouTube.